G'day, I'm Clive and welcome to CDP Outdoors. We're going to have a taste test of the beef bolognese from On Track Mills, gourmet meals for the outdoors. Now I had one of these the other day, not this flavour, a different one. And I enjoyed that one, so I'm hoping this is as good as that one. Uh, an MRE, which is a uh, meal ready to eat. So it's not your super lightweight meals for normal hiking, but if you don't mind carrying that little bit extra weight and if you want something decent, I think this is the way to go with something like this. So this one, as like I said, is a beef bolognese, tender beef and vegetables in a traditional Italian homemade style tomato sauce. Ready to uh, eat meal, not dehydrated. Uh, heating instructions: Place sealed pouch in boiling bag, uh, boiling water for three to five minutes, or empty pouch into the pan and heat through. Best enjoy with rice, pasta, or mashed potato. Store in a cool, dry place. Refrigerate uh, once opened for up, uh, yeah, up to three days. Energy 1200 kilojoules, protein 19.7, fat total 18.2, saturated 6.1, carbs 7.9, sugars 5.5, sodium 696 milligrams. Serving size 250 grams. That's one serving. Now, the last one I did, I did heat up in the pot. So this time, I'm gonna actually try it with boiling water. So let's get my little stove set up. I've got one that's almost empty, and one with a fair bit in, but I wanna use this one up first. So if you see me swap this over, you know why. So I'm out in the bush, at the shelf on the bill on my track, and I keep hearing a kangaroo or something over there. Let's get that. Squish it a bit. Put it in there. Squash it all the way down. That's it. Get some water. Let's cover the package. Get that on the go. Put the lid on so it heats up quicker. Yeah, I've just walked out. 10.5 kilometers, so it's 6.4, 6.5 6 miles. So I'm looking forward to something to eat now. And the most of that, 10.5, was a nice gentle incline uphill all the way. Because just over there is Mount Dale. And you can see it going all the way up, and it's beautiful. And we're about halfway up that from where I originally started. Right, I'm going to speed the camera up now until this is all boiling and I'll come back after it's had three to five minutes to heat. expected because that gas canister has been almost empty. Turn 
plus. Pour the boiling water into that one so I don't scald myself. Dirt in the bag out. This one's only got the little notches at the top here to rip the top open. Shani didn't have some more a little bit further down to make it easier so we could have eaten it straight out of the bag with a longer spoon. It's the top of it. Now, taste. It looks consistency. It looks really nice. That is nice. Mm. I'm surprised about that. And if you throw some more Bolton pasta at the same time and throw it in with this, it go really nice. Mm. I'd like to say some rice or mashed potato. I think if you did that, you'd get one very large serve or two average meals. So with the weight you're carrying here, if you split the weight in your pack, you're not going to be carrying much more weight and you'll be getting a decent meal. Hmm. So, instead of a bag of rice or some pasta of some sort, yeah. I'm trying to figure out what this reminds me of. I know mice is out now, big buggers. I know it's a bolognese in the mince, but oh, there's a big chunk of tomato. It doesn't taste like one out of a jar. You now you buy the ones and just pour it in, one of them sauces there. Uh, they've got their own taste to them, their own flavour. It's still nice. This is, I don't like to say this, what's this say? Something about, um, yeah, it's like, it, is, it tastes more like home cooked. Again, maybe it's just me being greedy, but throw a bit more mint in there. But there's plenty of sauce, and it's it's, it's not as if there's not enough mints. It's just half a little bit more. Hmm. So, would I recommend it? I think you already know the answer. It's because I haven't stopped eating it. I'll have it again for definite. Stuff like this, I really do like. This is a really, really nice one. Yeah, I enjoyed the last meal. I did the review of, so we can have a look at that. But 
air. It says may contain fish or tree nuts. Uh, what have we got in it? Minced beef, tomato, pork, crushed tomatoes, acidity, regulator, water, celery, red capsicum, carrot, onion, red wine, salt, preservatives, canola oil, salt and herbs. A uh, made in facility that also makes products of the same production lines uh, containing gluten, crustacean, egg, fish, milk, peanuts, sesame, soy, uh, tree nuts, lupin and sulfites may therefore be present and halal suitable. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll have this again so that's my way of saying I recommend it because if you've got a very similar taste to me I think you'll like this one. Is it worth taking carry next weight? Definitely. Definitely. Hmm. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you have, and it's the first time you've been to my channel, or you haven't subscribed already, please go down below and click on the subscribe button. Click on the notification bell and select all. Click the thumbs up, the like button. Share it with all your mates and your family. And if you are already a subscriber, again, I thank you very much. So until next time, get out there, have some fun and take care. Now I'm going to finish this off.